Welcome back to our unique course IT support resume applying for jobs and communities. Now in this course we went through a lot of stuff, uh, sample resume specifically for entry level IT professional, searching for a job as an IT professional and then some interview uh, you know, questions for, from the people that have already landed a job. So you, you have a pretty good idea now and you actually have something practical and you join the communities and everything but now you need something a little bit more than, uh, you know, for generic questions like very basic questions where people will ask you regardless of your IT uh, um, job that you're applying for. This is just behavioral. Uh, they just want to know your customer service skills. They just want to know you. Like, you know, tell me about yourself. Uh, tell me, the uh, you know, if you had any, uh, you know, situation where um, you got stressed or, you, or where a customer was really upset. How did you handle that? Stuff like that is, uh, you know, something that you want to go to Indeed Career Guide then. The reason I picked this because, think about it, this is one of the, the biggest, uh, you know, uh, site for jobs so so in, in their terms they, they will be providing best content so people can get jobs you know and they, they get be, they become more successful so then they can talk about indeed you know this is how it works and um, it's really really nice because if you go to finding a job we already talked about that resume and cover letter we talked about that but but you can actually go in there and find something new you don't have to just follow our rules you know like I said we're a few people but they may have specialists sitting in there so this is why I recommend that you come to this site and use it because they have a step-by-step -step approach just like ours. But you have to be careful because the first two are covered by us. So you have a very specific target right here. There is generic, you know. So they, they may tell you what's the best way to finding a job, which you can find a lot of good things in there. So maybe if we haven't covered it, you should watch. You should come here and look into these blogs. If you are struggling with our resume, our template, then you should come here and change some things. Um, interviewing, uh, this is the part that you will be getting a lot from this area because we covered what we have covered from other members, right? And But we haven't covered everything in a broader perspective, meaning people can ask you questions about, tell me about yourself, and, and so how do you deal with it? So this is the perfect place to come here, and you can see, guide how to be successful. So here, uh, 12 tough interview questions and answers. When you go into it, you see how detailed uh, it is. So somebody put a lot of work in there, so thank you to Indeed team you know they have done look at this work right here everything is in detail and then it even takes you to more links if you feel if they feel uh, you know there's a confusion they will they will take you to another link but they have examples which I like you know so everything tell me about the time you overcame an obstacle so example that the uh, introduction and then they have example how do you handle stress example right here uh, so this is a best place to come here and uh, use this because it's such a great um, you know information so you can go back now what to wear for the interview interview questions what are what are your strengths and weaknesses this is very basic question everybody gets it uh, you know and all of this stuff all of this stuff nine best questions to ask interviewer with video examples so they have a video examples too I feel like you shouldn't miss this at all. You know, this is just too good. You know, too good of information right here. And everything, uh, you can come here. And they even have a specific uh, areas. But, of course, that's not going to be your. You can, if they have something helped us, maybe I'll share it next time. But I didn't find it. But at least you can come here and, and get get through these basic ones, right? Accounting one, introduce yourself. Like, you know, how to introduce yourself in an interview. And you have a really nice start by researching the company. Dress appropriately. Avoid distractions. Keep an eye contact. Be confident. Be aware of body language. Prepare what you what you have to say. This is a thing that we have discussed in our previous videos where a lot of people have came and, and actually told you what to do, right? Before interview, recommended videos to watch. Uh, before a preparation on the site interview. This is where we have discussed that. The whole video is about this, that how do you... Uh, you know, go about your interview uh, and how do you actually tell people about the jobskillshare.org because there are going to be questions about technology, how do you update yourself, Where, what kind of communities do you follow. People can ask you these questions because this is specifically about IT now. And another thing that I wanted to tell you that do come to this one too, before interview recommended videos to watch. This is the videos that we have created before this course, basic, uh, basic active directory training before help this interview. This is a is a must before you go to the interview for Active Directory. Help this one. We have a full help this one for this also. You should watch these two videos. And then 
if you're a premium or a premium member, you should actually take some labs and the recommended lab is a network plus lab. Even if you haven't finished this, you should go over this lab because they have, you know, ports like, you know, what are the, the common ports, FTP, SNMP, SMB, you know, this stuff you will practically learn it, not just by, uh, you know, reading some Google stuff, you actually do it. So then you can actually give a better example that I have actually done labs on these things. So even if you are new to technology and you don't have experience, you don't have a, a, a past experience to talk about in your interview, you can talk about this lab that how you have performed. That's that's what they want to hear, you know, if somebody asks you these type of questions. So I hope that you will come to this course, fully go over it. And then I feel like 80% of the time you will be confident you're, because all of the things will be covered. Then that 20% is something you should contact us and let us know what, you, what you're what you going through. So then maybe if we have the answer, we'll give it to you. So that's how you should really, really approach. So it's a stress-free searching and applying for jobs and getting the jobs. In my next video, I'll talk about what to do after landing a job. That's another. So, yeah, you're, it's not over because now you land, you are looking for a job, the stress, and, and you got the job, you're happy. But the new stress will come right after that. The first day when you go there, the next day you're going to get some tickets. And that's where you're going to be thinking. Jobskillshare.org is the, the key right here. If not, then you're going to have struggle in these these areas yes you landed a job perfect but what about now learning all these these uh, skills how do you quickly move up from there how do you how do you not get stuck in the help this that's what we're going to discuss next